The Second Amendment states that Americans have the right to bear arms. Lexington Chief of Police Sam Roman acknowledges the difficulties that police officers face while trying to protect people's rights and also their safety. There's a fine line for law enforcement, you know. Um, how much do you do in the name of safety without encroaching upon existing laws? And you just have to find that gray, that, 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 that area in the middle and, and operate there. Roman explained that Virginia is an open carry state. In order to carry concealed, um, there's a process through the court system that you must adhere to, which is uh, not an arduous process. Uh, uh, obviously, uh, if you're a convicted felon, uh, you're not allowed to carry a firearm. Manager of High Country Outfitters, Monty Jesse, says he carries his concealed firearm at all times for his own protection. I'm carrying a firearm right now and you do not see it and that's how I prefer it. Um, because there's, again, that misconception. You know, you'll see mothers grabbing their children, oh my God, he's got a gun. You know, even though you're not carrying it in a threatening manner whatsoever. Jesse believes in the right to carry a gun for personal safety, but he also supports background checks. Uh, as long as we do the paperwork on it and do the background check, it actually works. Um, we, we have had several instances where the person is actually denied uh, through the transfer process because of the criminal record or mental history or any type of domestic charge, anything like that. Mental health in relation to gun violence is also a big concern. Local gun owner Bo Kanick feels that gun problems stem from either terrorism or mental health issues. A gun is just an instrument. It takes this right here to make it work, okay? This and this up here. The gun is not the problem. It's the people behind it. From a law enforcement perspective, Chief Roman would like to see more action taken against gun violence. But at the same time, he doesn't want to encroach on anyone's rights. For The Rockbridge Report, I'm Bryn McCarthy.